hey guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to allow CapCut to have access to photos so if you want to import some photos or videos on your iphone to CapCut and you are seeing some error message or it is telling you to allow photo access let me show you how to do that in this video so the first thing you need to do is head over to your settings and you need to search for CapCut. so you can just scroll down and look for CapCut or just search for it Once you have seen CapCut, click on it and you need to select the photos at the top. So if you are using anything below IS 17, you are going to see something different from this. But it is still the same. They just give it a different name. So in IS, IS 16, sorry. In IS 16, it is non allow access to selected photos and allow access to all photos. So can you see it is just different names with the same meaning so if it is set to none like this you won't be able to import any photo or video to your cap cut and if it is set to limited access it's going to show up something like this it's going to tell you to select some photos and videos so anytime you open your cap cut to import some photos or videos it is only what you select that's going to show up in your cap cut but if you select this full access and you click on allow full access, it is all your photos and videos that is going to show on CapCut. So you just need to select the one you want to use. So I'm going to advise you all to make use of this full access or allow access to all photos. So you'll be able to pick any photo or video that you want to import. If you find this video helpful, smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this. So let's check let's click on new project and can you see it is showing everything so let's select limited so let's select limited access and let's click on done let's cancel this and let's click on new project can you see it is showing only what i selected so just go with this full option thanks for watching guys